Yo, what is up guys? It is Vortex here and welcome back to our video on the channel. In this video, we are on a game that some of you guys, some of the OGs may have heard of. It is called Rumble Quest and some of you guys may have heard of it and I'm back playing the game one year later. I have not, I stopped playing this game because they did stop updating which did kind of suck but I did want to just come back here after one year and just check it out because I just want to see all the past stuff that I've been doing which is pretty crazy. So yeah, I want to see everything that has still here been here. I mean, nothing changed but I want to see and just remember the game and get some nostalgia. See, let's get right into to it. So um, yeah, a lot of you guys did enjoy the content on this game. A lot of you guys really, really enjoyed it. I still have some videos that are still like get some tension because a lot of you guys are still watching, which is pretty crazy. But yeah, I did want to make one video on here, just showing the game off one year later since it's released and since I stopped playing it pretty much. So yeah, wanna, let's get into this. So I pretty much just jumped up here. I don't really remember much. I remember I jumped up here through this tree right here and got onto the buildings and got onto this roof, which I was at before. And I guess I have all these weapons and abilities and armors and stuff. I haven't done like any of this. I haven't touched this in like forever. So I guess I guess we do have it this ancient seer set which is pretty cool i don't know if this is the best stuff in the game it might be i could be wrong i literally forgot like everything guys and i still have a lot of this legendary armor here which is pretty cool so it's pretty nice to have and if we go over here guys as you can see i do have my two weapons right here the ancient daggers sadly these are not the legendaries i'm pretty sure i did have legendaries but they weren't as good and i think i traded it for like armor cosmetics or something but i do have this circ fender white which i think was pretty rare at the time i do not know if it's still rare anymore but it was definitely pretty rare at the time when I did have it, which is pretty cool. And we do also have this rainbow halo over here, which is pretty cool. I think they do have a shop we can look at. I don't know if they're like, it's uh, bundles. Okay, yeah, there's bundles and stuff, but there's still, this is the same special offers. And I guess the daily shop is like resetting every day, which is pretty cool. But they're definitely the same items. They're not bringing back any new items, I don't think. So yeah. But yeah, it kind of sucks that they did stop updating this game. This game was doing really good for them. I honestly don't really understand why they stopped updating because it was super, super fun to grind. And it was a really fun game, but... I don't know why they stopped it, but I'm gonna head into a game right now and just check out everything that I did miss. So if we click play right here, we do have these five maps, which is pretty cool. And I beat the first one six times, this one ten times, or I think I have the difficulties. So yeah, I beat this one on expert 17 times, this one on expert 281 times, this one on expert 220 times. This one on expert 196 times, and this one on expert 111 times. And I do also remember that you are able to do hardcore mode. So if you die once, you're out. So I'm just gonna do. I'm just gonna try a hardcore and see if I can beat it. Hopefully, hopefully I can beat it. But we're gonna go into here and just play one game and show it off. Alright, guys. Here we are in the game, and this is just so nostalgic. We can use our auto clicker, which we usually just do, and we're one shot these guys, which is pretty nice. And we do have both of our abilities. We can just spam. But I remember just doing this in like a while ago, which is pretty cool. And these mages are hitting us, but they're doing like literally no damage. And I think we're on the hardest difficulty. I don't, yeah, we're on the hardest difficulty on hardcore. So, and we're still just one shot and then we're taking like no damage, which is pretty crazy. So I think we should be able to get through this dungeon, I guess, which is pretty cool. So yeah, I think we also regenerate health, so we should be fine there. But yeah, guys, this game was super, super fun when I did play it. And as you can see at the top, we have 10 minutes to complete the dungeon, but this shouldn't be a problem considering I'm just destroying all these guys with these. So yeah. And also the level cap is 290. I, I wish if they at least stopped updating the game, I wish they at least raised the level cap to at least like make somewhat of a grind to like just make the, the level cap infinite or something. That'd be pretty cool. But I guess there's not really much incentive to grind anymore unless you're just going for leaderboards, but there's not really a point in that because the game isn't as alive as it used to be because it just stopped updating. But yeah, we're just going to go through this dungeon, I guess, and we'll come back once we are done so you guys can see another time lapse of me going through this. So yeah, here we go. Alright guys, here we are on the boss, the Temple Golem. I don't know how fast we're going to kill it. I'm hopeful, hoping we can kill it pretty fast. So here we go. We're going to go up to it. We're going to spam both of our abilities. Hopefully, okay, that doesn't do that much damage. We're going to spam both of these. And yeah, we just did so much damage. So this guy is literally already dead. He's gone already. So we got these items as rewards. We got 10 million experience and 670,000 coins. So yeah, we're just going to go back to the main menu and check out these items. Alright guys, so we did get a little stack right here, which is pretty cool. And we got some armor, but we do not need it. We have already a bunch of the armor sets, so we can just, honestly, we can just sell it. We don't need any of this. We can just get all that out of the way. We don't need any of that armor. We can keep everything else. We need, we can have everything else, I guess. We can just sell all that. And that will add on to our 150 million coins, so there we go. And also, if we go into the achievements, I've completed every single achievement except for these ones, which are just heal health. So I have to have 10,000 health, 
healed on your teammates. They're pretty much, I have to use a health um, person and just heal people, but I never did that really. Like, I very, very rarely did that, as you can see. I have barely healed any people, but I guess I could do it a lot more, but I don't really care. But other than those three, I've gotten every single other achievement in the game, which is pretty cool. I've dealt 5 billion damage in the game. I don't remember where you can see our stats. I think we, like... Click one of these, I think, it, okay, there we go. So, it says damage dealt, we've done 14 billion damage dealt, and we've taken 431 million damage. And just for reference, as you can see, I've earned 3 billion experience what it look, from what it looks like, and to get on the leaderboard, the number one person has 391 billion experience. So, they have, have had to grind for a very long time. I mean, I'm kind of close to the leaderboard already. I have, I have 3 billion, and I need to get to 12.8 billion to get on the leaderboard. So, I'm actually not terribly far. But considering I haven't grinded this game in a whole year, which is pretty crazy. So yeah, it looks like looking on the leaderboard will not be possible for me. Looks like I grind the game, but I don't really feel like doing that. And then I did forget, we also do have the daily rewards right here. I can claim the day one, which is pretty cool. I think on day six, you get like a cosmetic or something like that, which is pretty nice. But yeah, I think before I end off the video, I think I'm just going to give a lot of this armor stuff away in my server. Because I guess these people that are still playing the game, I can still give them some stuff. So let's just trade everyone. Let's see if anyone accepts the trade. So let's see if any person accepts it. Okay, this person accepted it. We'll give him a couple of armor pieces like that. So there you go. I hope he can enjoy those pieces. Let's just, okay, I guess he's giving us some desert armor um, heads and some legs. Okay, I guess whatever. We'll just take those, I guess, and he can have those items. So there he goes. So let's just trade a couple more people. I don't remember the username of the guy we just traded. I think it was this guy. So, okay, yeah, we're trading someone else. I'm pretty sure we'll give him some of this stuff too. We'll give him like, actually, I'll, I'll give him a head helmet and some legs. So there we go. He can have those items, I guess. So enjoy those. Hopefully these at least help him. There we go. And then we'll trade a, like one more person in here. Let's just find one more person we can do. We can send a trade to so here's someone else we can extend a trade to so we'll give him some of these and some of these i don't know what he's giving us he's giving us some, uh, some bone blades but he can have these two items so there you go for those and then we'll actually just trade one more person because i just i let's just i just get rid of everything else i had let's just trade one more person let's see if anyone accepts the trade so let's just keep spamming okay someone else accepted it i think this is a new guy as well we'll give him okay what is this he's a runic slicer and a ice valkyrie which is pretty cool i don't know what these are worth or anything which is pretty nice but let's just give him like some of that i guess i mean he can take that out if he wants i don't know if he wants to give me that i don't think he should but here i'll just give him this i mean i don't i really don't i'm just giving this for free but i don't know why he wants this in here all right so there we go i gave him that stuff so i guess that's the last trade i'm gonna do for now i'm pretty much down to actually i can do one more trade i can give someone else one person i think i traded that guy as well okay yeah, i sent i already traded that guy I'm going to try and find someone else that I have not gave anything to yet. So I think this is someone else. I think this is a different person. We can give him one of those. And I think we can give him one of these. So there we go. He can have those items. I guess I'll just give pretty much everything else out. So there we go. I pretty much have like nothing less than my inventory. But I gave a lot of that stuff out just because why not. But um, yeah guys, that was pretty much me returning one year later to the game. I just want to check it out and get some nostalgia. And I'm not going to make any more videos on this game sadly because they just... Do not update. I mean, if they update, obviously, I'll obviously make some videos on the game, but they have stopped updating it, which kind of sucks. But hopefully, there's maybe a new game that can come out that's similar to this. That would be pretty cool. But yeah, this is pretty much just going to conclude the Rumble Quest game as a whole. And I'm probably not going to make any more videos on it, as I said, unless something else comes up into the game, which is pretty nice. But this is the final video on the game. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the content on this game. This is the end of it. Don't worry, there's still a bunch of other games that I'm making videos on and stuff. This, so this is not the end at all. But this is the end for this singular game. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys join the Discord server. The link is in the description. Maybe I'll give out like this last three sets of armor in there just because why not? Might as well give the last of my stuff to you guys. Make sure you guys get some Roblox merch. Link is also in the description. And make sure you guys subscribe to the channel because we're on the road to 20k subs, which is insane, guys. This support on the channel recently has been so good. So thank you guys so much for that. So, but yeah, it's Boomer Vortex, and I'm out. Peace.